All right, what is going on, guys? It's your boy Crossviper, and I'm back with a brand new video. Today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get colors on your cars, like these colors right here, or you guys can call them like 3D colors or modded colors, stuff like that. Technically, they kind of are modded colors because you can't really just like go out and buy them. You have to do like a little glitch, which I'm gonna be showing you guys in the video. And um, yeah, I have one car. Like those cars look have all these cars all have like kind of modded colors. But there's one car that has a really nice color that I'm going to be showing you guys how to get. And it's pretty sick. So th this is the color right here. It looks pretty sick. In the lighting, it looks even better. As you guys can see, it looks kind of, it's like a modded 3D-ish color. If you guys can see that right there. So what you guys are going to do, go to Los Santos Customs, bring any car. And you're just going to go ahead and pull up if this thing will open. All right, so um, yeah, you could you guys can use any car. Um, I use the X80, and I realized it didn't work that good with it because you need a car where the primary covers like the whole car. You don't want like a secondary to have over it. So you're just gonna go to colors, and then you're gonna go primary, and you're gonna put either a classic or a matte color. You can put either one. So um, you can put any color you want, but I'm just gonna go ahead and put purple because that looks kind of good. So I'm trying to find the purple right here. And using like brighter colors or like uh like i don't know how to explain it. it like brighter colors work a little bit better like so you're gonna put the purple then you're gonna go to uh you're gonna go uh to what the fuck am i you're gonna go to metallic and then you're gonna hover over this for a good five seconds and just you're just gonna sit here and count to five and then once you guys finish counting to five you're gonna go back and then go to plate and just buy anything. Just buy something cheap. And then you're going to go back to primary. And then you're going to go to pearlescent. As you can see, it will be unlocked. And you guys can put any pearlescent with the matte or um, with the matte or classic color. And as you can see, it like glitches through and makes a really nice color. And I'm just going here looking for a nice color that matches with it. And yeah, I'm just going to put this. See, as you guys can see, it like glitches the car out a little bit. And it makes it a really nice color. So you guys are wanna gonna do that. Um and you guys can't do this um unless you buy something, but you could just buy a plate, it's only like two hundred. And you guys are gonna need to hover over metallic or else the pearlescent won't unlock. So once you guys figure out your color, I'm just trying to figure out what to do for a secondary color. Cause it kinda messed this kinda messed up because you you guys need a car that the primary takes over like the whole car. And so yeah, I'm just trying to find the same exact purple so I can just go ahead and do the same thing. Um, but yeah, it's better when the primary just takes over the whole whole car. It looks a lot better. Um, as you can see on the other car, the Buccaneer I showed you guys a little bit earlier. I mean, this looks pretty nice, but you guys won't, can't really see it because the lighting in here is really dim. But when you guys go in a really bright lighting, you'll be able to see that really cool effect it has, like the little 3D. And it has like a really nice effect. And I'm just trying to match the colors here. And then once you guys figure out what colors you guys want... You're just going to go ahead and uh, leave Los Santos. But yeah, this looks pretty nice. I'm um, just trying to see like how good it looks. It looks pretty good. So that's all you guys are going to do. It's not that hard. And uh, this is kind of a glitch because you can't really do it. You have to hover over and stuff. So you're just going to go, once you look at it, and if you like it, you can just go ahead and take it back to your garage. So once you get back to your garage, you're just going to put it there. And I'm trying to find good lighting, as you can see, so I can show you guys a little 3D effect it has. As you can see, you can see on the other car right next to it, it has that little 3D effect I put on there. I put it on, like, all of my cars, and it has a really cool modded color. Uh, but, yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video and if you guys want some more colors or glitches and stuff or G any GTA 5 videos, just let me know, and I'll try and get out there for you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace.